Welcome to our quick guide on how to set up a connectivity gateway using software-defined automations Docker feature, which is now available in Flex Marketplace. In just a few simple steps, we'll show you how to streamline your industrial automation process like never before. This Docker feature simplifies the gateway creation, eliminating the need for specific operating system requirements. Let's get started. In your Flex environment, head over to the Marketplace. Type SDA in the search field and click to install our secure remote access app. For me, it took about 40 seconds to conclude. You can drink a bit of your coffee meanwhile. Once it is successfully installed, go to your apps and click to open the SDA app in a new tab. This is our user interface where we can set up and remove the gateways we created in the SDA web console. Let's jump to the web console now. First, sign in with your user credentials, and here you create a new gateway. Simply navigate to the Gateway section on the left and click on Add a new device. Select Gateway and click on version 2, since this is the one that corresponds to our newest feature. Here at the bottom, you can select if you want your gateway to connect to your network servers using UDP or TCP, depending on your firewall rules. Then you give your gateway a sensible name and save it. This is going to load a command line that we need to configure the gateway in our Flex environment. Click on it to copy it. Let's head back to your application. Paste the command in the text field and click on Submit. We are now configuring the connectivity credential access in our gateway device. Once it is successfully configured, the gateway is ready to be used by our SDA features, such as the ID as a service and the deployment and backup services. We can validate it by going back to the web console, selecting the new gateway and check the connectivity status. If you face any issue, make sure you read our firewall requirements in the documentation page and have a look at the Connectivity V2 service. Thanks for watching and don't forget to visit our website for more guides and tips.